All right. Hey everyone, so I wanted to come on here and talk to you guys on this Friday about having your calling and how important having a calling is. On the other day, we were watching the movie Justice League and um, it was the four hour one. It's extremely long. If you do not um, know about it, it's actually a really good movie to watch. But we were watching that particular movie. And in the movie, they knew that in order to complete the mission that they needed to complete, they needed Spider-Man. Not Spider-Man, they needed Superman. Superman was so, um, I guess, powerful against the very thing that they needed to fight. Okay, listen to me. So they had to go and get S Superman. And they had to take him back to the ship that he was from. And as they were carrying his body, as he was dead, you guys, they were carrying his body in. And um, it was like these, these, these walls, right? But as soon as his body came across the wall, it flipped out like this and it was one uniform. And then the other one flipped out, it was another uniform. So as he, as his body passed by, the uniforms were flipping out. And when they got him all the way through the uniform section, they went back into the wall. But one of the other people that was on the team from Justice League instantly said, they know he is here. Now... What am I saying today? I am here to give you a quick encouragement to let you know that your calling still stands. It does not matter whether you are doing whatever you are out here doing that doesn't have anything to do with God. It does not matter if you are out here and you feel like I'm not ready for uh, being saved. I, I remember being one of those people who said, I'm going to go to Christ. I'm going to get my life together when I'm finished enjoying myself when I finish doing what I want to do but I am here to tell you your calling still stands the very thing that is connected to you know when you are in the atmosphere when you get to a place when you get to a place the walls begin to change and it begins to pull out the suits or the missions that are ordained directly for you that is attached to your name I am here to tell you today that everything that is attached to your name stands today your calling stands today who you are and who you are supposed to be it still stands today and God has a plan for who you are supposed to be so I'm asking you on today will you choose will you choose to line up will you choose to fight the battle in the movie Superman had to make a decision he had to make the decision even though they awakened me even though they have awakened me even though I'm in transition even though some things are going on in my life I ain't got time to help nobody else out I ain't got time to fix nothing for nobody else I got to worry about me right now even though all of that was probably on his mind he had to be awakened in order for some things to take place in his life because they needed him can I tell you that on today somebody needs what you have in your mouth they need what you have in your hand they need what you have in your head. They need what you've been hearing. They need what you got to say. They need you. And I need you to understand you have to line up. You got to get into the right place because baby, it is the right time. The time is now. Your calling still stands and it is in the room. In Jesus name, amen. Let me just say a quick prayer for you. For those of you who are unsure right now, I'm just going to pray. Lord God, we pray right now in the mighty name of Jesus, God, that you will awaken the call that is on each and every person's life. Awaken it so that it is so woke. It is getting up and it is getting itself prepared so that it keeps us uncomfortable in walking in whatever it is that we are doing and trying to walk away from your call. Oh God, we're asking you on today, oh God, that you give the people who are saying, I am ready. I am up i am dressed they got their shoes on they are fully dressed they are ready and prepared to fight this great fight that is out here for us and what they're saying is is god send me i'm right here i'll go so oh god we're asking right now god that you send the ride to their household god allow the ride to get there and beat the horn and say come on out your ride is here i'm here to take you to your destination allow them to be ready to go exactly where it is that you have for them to go and the mighty 
name of Jesus. God, we're asking right now, Lord, for those ones who are like, well, Lady K, what is my call? Oh, God, we're asking you right now, God, that you open that you open the ear gates, oh God, so that they can hear your voice to know exactly where it is they need to go. God, open their eye gates, God, so that they can see exactly where it is that they need to go in the mighty name of Jesus. God, we give you glory. We give you honor and we give you praise because you are worthy to be praised, oh God. You are worthy to be praised. Now, can somebody drop something at the bottom that says, I'm ready. I'm ready and I'm willing and I am here because I'm ready for the call. Amen. Have an amazing weekend. You guys, stay connected to God. Stay connected to God. I didn't say stay connected to the church. I said stay connected to God, okay? Amen. All right, I'll catch you guys next time. Bye.